Welcome to my Descript Remove Silence in Gaps tutorial, where if you want to see how you can very quickly create jump cuts, this is going to be the video for you. If you haven't gotten to test out Descript, or maybe you just want to follow along, I will leave a link in the description. And if you click that, you can start off for free, see what they have to offer and go from there. Let's begin. So what I did is create this very quick video of me just talking and I purposely just rambled and put some blank spots there where we can edit those very quickly. You'll see. So there's one in the beginning, I guess, one there, another one there, and of course, another one down below. So what I want to do, I was going to play this and show you that there's, you know, like a three second gap. So give me one second. Cuts very easily. Every now and then I just have to... Yeah, it's a lag in a little just because I have so much running. But here's how it actually gets done. So I'll put this back here. What we want to do is click on this star button right here. So shorten word gaps, remove word fillers, and so on and so forth. We want to shorten the word gaps here, which is going to be these gaps that you see in between where the pauses are. So what we can do is we can change the amount of time where we want to shorten it to. Like I could do two seconds, uh, but that probably won't be a whole lot, right? So we could do like one second, or you can even do what I had before is like 0.5 if you really want to make them shorter. And what we can do is apply to all. So now you'll see is that there's a lot less space there. And what I can actually do, I'm going to undo that with control Z just to show you. So shorten word gaps and I can do like 0 0.25 to make them really snappy. So apply to all. And you'll notice there's going to be a very quick gap right there. So start off right here. And what I want to do is just, I'm going to play this and that's pretty much going to be the tutorial. Like I said, it only takes a few clicks of your mouse and that can save you a ton of time, especially if you're doing a video where you have your gaps in there. And every time there's a gap, you can just tell it to, Hey, cut that off and then you'll be good to go. So thank you so much for watching and enjoy. There might be some lag, but you'll be able to see how it works. So the purpose of this video is to show you how you can actually create some jump cuts very easily. Every now and then I just have to pause to show you like how it can go from one segment to the other. And then of course you can edit this. Yeah, there was definitely some lag, but the jump cuts are there. Normally it's not going to work like that. Like I said, my computer's about to explode. Thank you so much for watching. If you have any questions, feel free to leave a comment down below and I'll see you in my next video.